goddamn button. Press the goddamn button. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Go ahead and click that red button right there. And also click that bell for notifications and select all. All right. Yo, 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 Games and Graphics. We are making a building with another GTA 5 mod tutorial for you. And we are going to be installing Visual 5. This right here is created by CP and Robbie29. Shout out to the creators. When you get down to this download page, what you want to do is read the full description. All right. From bottom to to top all right and after you get done reading the full description come up here where it says current and select the green arrow to download all right now let's jump into the requirements we are going to need open four and um, of course we're going to need scriptbook v scriptbook all right but i will leave those links down in the description to videos showing you how to install uh, scriptbook v scriptbook v and open four if you don't have it already all right so once you have your requirements installed and you have your visual five downloaded on the left hand side I have one download which is Visual 5 and on my right hand side I have my Grand Theft Auto 5 directory opened up. I have my requirements installed and ready to go. Now for this one we are going to need a mods folder inside of our GTA 5 directory. So if you don't have a mods folder go ahead and create a new folder and name it mods all in lowercase. Once that has been created we can go ahead and open up our open 4. I have my open 4 open up on the right hand side. Let's make sure that we have our edit mode turned on. It's this little button right here you want to turn that on. After that is turned on let's go to our downloads where we have our visual 5 folder and open that up. Inside that folder, we are going to have three more folders and a text document. It will go, uh, the first folder will be our installation via mod package. The second one will be the optionals, and the third one will be the, op the original files. Okay, so pretty much this will be your uninstalled. Okay, if you go inside the original files, there will be an OIV right here that will revert all of the modified files back to the original files. And if you go inside your optionals, you will have your different optionals to install. Uh, first one is your advanced motion blur. Then you have dynamic shadow from pedestrian vehicles, Earth's atmosphere, EMB settings, proce procedural, procedural shadows, excuse me, removed grass tethering or deathering in trees reflections, and reshade preset. This one has uh, performance loss right here. So um, use this at your own risk, okay? We will not be installing none of the optionals today. We will only be installing the mod package which is the visual 5 okay it's just a graphic mod by itself that's the only one we are going to be installing so go ahead and open up the installation via mod package folder and we are going to select the visual 5 oiv package and drag and drop that over to open 4. once you drag and drop that over to open 4 you're going to have a package installer window that's going to open up you want to select install then you want to select the mods folder that we just created or the mods folder that you already have. Then you want to select install confirm installation. After that is done, we're all good to go. OK, now let me go briefly over the optionals. I'm going to bring back up my GTA 5 directory right here on the right hand side. Now let's go back over to our downloads where we had our installation via my package folder open and we're just going to go back. Then we're going to go into the, uh, the optionals, excuse me, we're going to go into the optionals folder. In the optionals folder, we are going to have these options I went over earlier. Now I'm going to show you how to install them. I will not install them. I'm just going to go briefly and show you how to install these, okay? So the first one for advanced motion blur, open that folder up, you're going to have two files in a readme you want to select these two files right here and you want to drag and drop those two inside of your gta 5 directory this is going to give you advanced blur and the next one will be the dynamic shadows from pedestrian vehicles open up that folder you're going to have these two files right here you want to just highlight both of those two drag and drop them over to your gta 5 directory um, if you go inside the Earth's atmosphere, open up that folder. Uh, this one's going to be a little bit uh, more installation than the first two. You do have some photos right here that shows you exactly what this mod does. All right. So what you want to do is take these two files right here, drag and drop these two over to your GTA 5 directory. Then you want to open open four again and select this and drag and drop this into your open four. And that will open up a package installer window. You want to select install, select mods folder, and then wait for the successfully installed message. All right. 
Now let's go back and go to the next one, EMB settings right here. Um, you want to have EMB installed already, I believe. Let's see. Yes, you definitely want to have EMB installed already. And then after that, you can take all of these except the text document right here. You can take everything except the text document and you can drag and drop everything over here to your GTA 5 directory. Now let's go to the next one. Procedural shadows. Open up that one. And this one's going to be an OIV package. So you're just going to take this one, drag and drop it in, open four, package installer window will open up, select install, mods folder, and install confirm installation. All right, and going to the removed grass dethering and tree reflections, this is going to be an OIV package as well. Same procedure like the last with the shadows. And we are going to go to reshade inside here first you want to have reshade installed and then you're going to simply grab everything in this folder drag and drop it into your gta 5 directory all right so that is uh briefly how you install the optionals if you wanted to okay so now that we have visual 5 installed let's go ahead and minimize any other windows we might have open and run the game all right as soon as you spawn in you should see the effects take place right away if you just look around, I'm going to drive around in a uh, few places, show you how it looks uh, during the day as well as at night. All right, we'll start off in uh, this neighborhood right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, teleport to the beach. All right, we are at the beach. Looks pretty good. Let's go down a little closer to the water. Whenever I install graphic mods, I always like to check out the, the detail in the sand. You know, as well as uh, the water and, you know, different shades and everything like that. Yeah, I definitely like to come down to the beach and check out the detail in the sand. You got good detail on the people as well. Alright. Hey ladies, no, I'm not gonna hit you. You're just showing off the detail on your skin and your body. <laughs> Alright. But everything looks good down here at the beach. Now let's check out um, another area. All right, we are down here on uh, Great Ocean Highway. Now I'm just driving around in certain areas just so you can see how, uh, oh, <laughs> see the graphic effect if I could stop crashing. <laughs> but it looks pretty damn good, man. Visual 5 has always uh, looked good after being installed correctly. Um, you have the optionals also that you could put in. But um, I always suggest just to install it by itself just to see, you know, how it looks. And then you can see what uh, you would like to improve from there. Now let's go ahead and drive at nighttime so you can see how it looks at night. All right, we are on West Vinewood right now. As you can see, it looks like it brings out the, the lights on the car more also. Or just the lights, period. I love the reflection, too. All right, driving down. And we'll park over here. Up, oh, up, oh, I'm not gonna hit you. Just hit the curb, just relax, people. <laughs> just relax, everything's okay. I win again. Hey, how are things? Man, calm down, man. I'm trying to do this tutorial and stuff, man. Get out of here. Alright. <laughs> so, like I said, man, it looks pretty damn good, yo. Especially at night, man. It looks smooth. All right, all right. Noise, noise. Well, we're going to end the tutorial here. 
But if this helped y'all out to install Visual 5 or you just enjoyed the video, feel free to smash that like button for me. Definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. E and share the video with y'all friends that are in the modding GTA 5. Y'all's games and graphics, me and a big bowling ass Frank. We are out of here. Till next time. I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.